Hey guys, D-Mike here for another episode of Super Nintendo Sundays wrapped up the bonus level of World 2 a little bit too quickly last time because we're pretty epic. So we did a little bit of World 3. We'll do a little bit more World 3. We're going to start with 3-3. Three, three. Nepe... Nepenets? What does that mean? I don't know. I have no idea. But anyway, welcome, welcome everybody. Hopefully you're all doing well. We're just having some fun here on a Sunday afternoon with this big old hungry fella here. Looks like he wants a snack. He gets his snack and he gets a little bonk on the mouth. No freebies. So just a heads up about Super Nintendo Sundays. Just wrapped up Kirby recently. Oh, Kiki's taking a bath. We just, uh, we just wrapped up Kirby, and as per usual, when a series is done, it will be replaced by something else. But I realize, looking back at what I've already accomplished as part of this series, that I haven't... I think I'm behind on an episode of Yoshi's Island, so I'm gonna go ahead and double up on it. So you'll have this episode today. Then I'm gonna do some Do-Re-Mi, so it'll be a bit of a Do-Re-Mi sandwich. We'll get you some Yoshi's Island, then another Do- a do a Yoshi's Island, a Do-Re-Mi, and a Yoshi's Island. So that's how we'll do it, and that should bring us up to being ready for the new series, which will be exciting. I've been trying to play with ways to make old stuff have a new twist on it, so that's fun. I'm sorry, Mario. Oh, can we not die here? Nope. Oh, this is horrible. Oh, come on. Oh my gosh. Everything's horrible. Ooh, that was close. But yeah, so that's the way I'm gonna do it. That way you get a nice little taste of everything. And it gets us kind of back on track. Yoshi's Island is probably going to be sticking around for a little bit as a series. I'm not quite as far through it. What is the point of these birds? <laughs> that was kind of funny. But yeah, so... I'm going to want to play some catch-up. And that will allow me to get everything back in ship shape. Ooh, that's a weird looking shock. Look at him. Oh, he's inflated. I don't quite understand what's going on there. Okay. Lots of Kikis in this episode. I keep calling them Kikis. I don't know if they have a uh, specific name. They probably do, but I don't know it. And I won't know it. Unless you tell me. But yes. So getting all of the Yoshi's Island and Do Re Mi squared away will give us a clean entry into the new series, which is going to be a lot of fun. And I'm trying to, like I was trying to say before I interrupted myself, I'm trying to find kind of interesting new ways to present the games that are played here. It makes it a little bit more unique. Unique New York, potentially? Potentially. Wow. Cannot talk. But it's fine, because we are Helicopter Yoshi. It's been a while since we've actually had a Yoshi power-up. Okay. And I think that there is a, yeah, a little, nice little landing pad down here. Not sure why the backtrack was done with the helicopter power-up, but I'm not complaining, because it's fun and it's adorable, so. Looks like this is a new power-up. Looks like we're going scuba diving. Submarine time. I don't have any experience with this, but this is pretty darn adorable. Let's go ahead and see what powers we have. Looks like we can shoot missiles. That's amazing. Time to kill some underwater s creatures here that are getting all up in our business. Oh, whatever. These cheap cheeps are fast. Oh, we gotta hurry. Grab the thing. No! Okay. Well, that's a bummer. We did clear out a lot of the enemies, though, so that should make getting through this spot a little bit easier. Oh, nope, they just came right back. 
you can just kind of infinitely fire these missiles, apparently, but you gotta do a little bit of work navigating around them. There we go, a little refresh of our submarine power. I love a nice sub. Nice meatball sub, maybe? Do you have any favorite sandwiches, viewers? Are there any things that you enjoy eating that... in the realm of sandwiches that make you happy? Oh, that coin looked like it was purple. I guess that's what happens when red and blue come together. They make slightly worse red, like I've mentioned before. We're just gonna keep swimming and... firing away. I do like this power-up. It's pretty easy to manage, and it's adorable. Okay, so that puts us here. There's a cool little diversion, I suppose. I'll allow it. Okay, we've got a frog here. He's just hanging out. And now he's dead. Oh, okay. I'm not entirely sure what just happened, but okay. We are... Oh, no, 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 no. Everything's horrible. No, stop, quit. We gotta click. Oh, my gosh. There's some, there's some moments in, in this game when you have the, uh... Things just happen, like, kind of, like, pure chaos. That's how this is right now for me. Oh, look at that crab. We got crabs. All right, let's grab these. I, I still don't know the proper name for those. Let's grab these stars and just get the H out of here. All right. <laughs> he just kind of seemed like a little, like, Hey, thanks for hitting me. I'm a fro. I totally get it. I totally get it, Mr. Frog. I'm trying to take, try to take Mario, though. That's rude. That's our baby. You can't have it. Okay, this is a, one of the things I've noticed about some of these levels that I get further and further along is they're just they are long. Like a lot of these levels are very very long, and that's probably intended. But okay, this this is making my brain feel a little weird. I did like the, I do like the way Yoshi goes down steps. It's nice. Okay, another opportunity for more eggs. I don't really know if I need that many, but... I guess for those of you who are a little bit low on your protein, eggs are a cheap, easy source of that. Oh my gosh. <laughs> this is all just pure chaos. As I wade through the peanut butter. Okay, we got every flower that time around. That's amazing. I mean, we get it every time, no matter what, but... Okay, great. I didn't want the bonus anyway, it's fine. Okay. 100%, once again. Okay, looks like we got a bit of a, a battle with the frogs here. Prince Froggy's Fort. Wonder if he's friends with Richard. From Link's Awakening. Got a bell sprout here, spitting eggs. I'm trying to spit eggs. It's not your typical, uh, not your typical boss area. Ooh, oh no. Oh, no, no, everything's horrible. What have I done? Okay. No, stop. Okay. Can this make stairs? Oh, okay. Uh, I mean, I guess I needed that sort of. Not really, but. Oh, this. Oh, this is one of them dumb fake flowers. I fell for it. I'm falling for it again. Another one. That's actually a really good enemy design. It looks so real. Got me good, okay. So yeah, this uh, feels a little atypical in the realm of forts, which is a nice change of pace. I, I feel like they could, in the same way that I, that I feel like it's a bit of a miss in Super Mario World, I'm not gonna fault them for a game that had come out in like 1992 or whatever, but I do feel like with the forts and the castles in Mario World that they could have mixed it up, you know. Okay, those guys take three hits each. I can't even finish them off. And you know how much I love finishing people off. I couldn't even do that. Okay. I'm gonna need you to excuse yourself. Thank you. What happens, like, biologically when Yoshi turns things into eggs. Are they dead? But thankful for that egg refresh. 
Okay. Uh, do I ha maybe I have to kill the crabs? I feel like that's part of my problem. I got crabs and I gotta deal with it for real. No ignoring this problem. So as we saw, it takes three shots. This is a very weird little room. I'm not entirely sure why it exists. But he is stuck. So we will help him. We will free him from the shackles of this tiny room. Okay, it was just for a flower. Great. Used all my eggs too. What a waste. Alright, so let's go refill our egg meter. No. Oh my gosh. Kiki. Now is not the time. I don't know if this room is required. I think there's still, yeah. Still space for me to go this direction. Oh boy. <laughs> we will move back from the spiky pendulum of doom. Oh my gosh. That dumb old spitting fish. Stop spitting, you're wasting my time. I'm trying to save my baby. Oof, I don't know how that doesn't quite trigger that hitbox, but whatever. We are uh, floating in a shallow pond right now. We are not doing so hot. Once again, I don't know what I'm doing, so hopefully I can figure this out in a reasonable amount of time. What does this do? Can we float in this? <gasps> we can. Oh, but you have to stay in it. That would make sense, wouldn't it? I think it's adorable that you've got Yoshi right now in Mario, toting him along in this tiny little bucket. I mean, it actually must be a pretty big bucket if you think about it, relatively speaking, compared to, you know, Mario. Okay. So this is, seems like a bit of a maze. Is this not where I need to go? Like, this is super confusing. Uh, okay. Well, we will dip out of here and continue along. There's a bit of a uh, pendulum here, a little pendulum platform. We're gonna have to dodge these shy guys trying to blow us up. I do love their assembly line of, of, of aggression. Oh boy. Hey there, Mario. I got you, buddy. Okay. Yeah, I thought that they would have to pass it all the way down. Apparently not. They just go for it wherever they want. This seems a little unfair. Ooh. But we are safe for now. Ooh, yeah, this level is a little tricky. They're not messing around. All right. Let's see if we can get back to spinning around. We don't have a ton of, I guess, health. So we gotta mind ourselves. Also, this little sound effect is a little annoying. Not a huge fan. Oh, Whew. not a huge fan. I, I just keep thinking in my head as I'm playing this that any sort of movement into the water is gonna kill me. Like I keep forgetting that it doesn't. Ooh, halfway point. We'll take it. That feels pretty good. All right. Okay. I don't understand. The weird cauliflower crab here. Is it good to kill it? I don't know. We have done it. I don't I don't quite understand what the arrows are trying to tell me. So I'll just continue along. It's very cryptic. Oh boy. I don't know if I have enough. Oh, maybe I have to. Oh, okay. I don't have enough. I don't have. Ooh, you gonna give me a little pinch? I don't have enough eggs for this, so maybe it's. Okay. How am I supposed to do that then? Maybe it wants me to jump up over it? Potentially. Well, we'll have to do a quick re. Oh, I guess I could have just jumped over it. <laughs> Whatever, I'm figuring it out. Okay, we're moving along. So I think that's what it's trying to tell me, is that as Mr. Krabs here trying to give me the bench that I can get out of the way. All right, success. 
Thank you, designers, for making such a challenging obstacle for me to overcome. All right, here he comes. He's gonna try to give me the beach. All right, we're just gonna sneak right past you. Now I'd imagine that we're getting ever so close to the boss. Okay, we saw this area a little bit earlier. Build ourselves a little platform so we don't have to touch them spikes with our toes. Whoa. Didn't I have a full complement of eggs? I did. I was like, I just hit this once, and I thought I hit it six times. Oops. Sometimes my brain is like, no. Wait, what? Do you not get to take them from place to place? What in the good gosh dang is that all about? Is that a glitch or something? Oh, I didn't pick them up. Oh. It's not a glitch, unless... In my mind, a glitch is being stupid. But sometimes it is. Being stupid kind of feels like your brain's glitching out, right? Okay, okay. We gotta get a boogie on, though. There's... These weird gumdrops behind us. Okay. Well, at least they're friendly. Delicious. Ooh. It's a little tricky flower if you're interested in grabbing it. I'm a little nonplussed about it. What does this do? These, yeah. Figure these would be stars. Okay, 29's pretty good. Oh. This game loves to have crap jump down from the ceiling to try to get us. Oh. We've come this far and that's the first thing that kills us? Boo. Not cool. Yes. Why would you say no? We've got a lot of lives though. I'm feeling pretty awesome about that. I think this is right before we do the hop over crabs. Yes. Come at me. Yeah, that's right. No hop over crabs for me. All right. So that was a pretty good amount of progress. We're almost done with this duo of levels. I really enjoy these kind of fortress levels. They're a little bit trickier, but the payoff is higher and I like that. Wow. We are like, this is like episode 11 of Yoshi's Island. And I still don't know how some of the mechanics work. So that's how you know that I'm doing really well. Or as I should say, doing super good. So that's where my brain's at right now. All right, this is actually kind of tricky. And I know that it's tricky to rock a rhyme right on time, but can we navigate the little twirly platform for success? Ooh. I mean, you have the challenge of like avoiding the things from the ceiling. Ooh. Almost as bad as Shy Guy's dropping bombs on us. It's like me having dinner with my family and there will be times when I'm talking to my parents and they'll be like, Hey, do you remember so-and-so when you were a kid? And I'll be like, yeah. And they're like, they are dead. And I'm like, okay. You know anybody like that who likes to kind of casually drop bombs on you? That's fun. Oh, no. No. We're at the boss door, though. Let's see what this is all about. All about the frog boss. Okay. See what Kamek has in store for us. Great job, Yoshi. Now you'll be Froggy's lunch. I think Froggy is a character that's also in like Tetris Attack. One of the things you can compete against. It's a really good game. Oh no! We're small. Oh, we're inside of Froggy. Well, this is unique. Okay. Is the game going to give me anything to use to... Oh my gosh. What is happening right now? This is wild. No. Oh, that's a huge egg. Oh my gosh. He's eating... Oh, I mean, it's not huge in the... Yeah. This is a really, really unique uh, boss. Good job, Nintendo. I like this. I'm not entirely sure what the drops of stuff are. Is that like pee? Don't drink pee, Froggy. It's bad for you. It is really hard to avoid 
getting hit by stuff, though. Alright. There we go. Yeah, these, uh, drops of lemonade or pee. Hopefully, hopefully it's lemonade. Are a little tough to avoid. Here we go. Oh, this is good. I feel like we're getting, a little, getting pretty close to taking Froggy out. He's got a he's got a Yoshi in his throat. Okay. Things are starting to feel a little tight down here. Oh my goodness! It's like impossible to dodge these things. No, Mario! No! That animation's a little creepy, isn't it? I'll restart from the middle ring, really. Oh, this middle ring. Okay, I got confused for a second. I was like, no! I thought we were gonna be set back a ways. Thankfully, we are not. Okay. Let's trigger this again. Let's get triggered. Now we're back at it, inside Froggy's belly once again. Yeah, this is a cool boss fight, I like this. It's unique. Just like you viewers, you're all unique. The spork of humanity. All right, so let's do better this time around. Let's keep it, uh, let's keep it moving. I think part of my problem is that I'm trying to eat the shy guy and also dodge the yellow things at the same time. I think taking a moment to collect the shy guy and then move is kind of the prime way to do it. Get the egg in your possession and then fire away. Yeah, this is a much better route. See, you live and you learn. It only took two tries so far. Shouldn't say that. But it gives me the full complement of uh, health back. Ooh, this is kind of tough. Oh my gosh, that hitbox is miserable. Oof. Yeah, this is not easy. Oh, goodness. Come on, come on, we got two shots here. Oh, just throw me a bone game. Oh no, he's gonna poop us out! Oh, he did poop us out. Oh my gosh. We were covered in froggy poo. Oh, we killed him. That's a really good, uh, really good sprite for Yoshi. I like that. How do we get out of here? Oh, okay. All right, 100% for the boss fight. That's awesome. Great job, everybody. Nice. Okay, so that was levels three, levels four for world three. Thanks for watching, everybody. I've been D Mike. This has been Super Nintendo Sunday's Yoshi's Island, and I'll see you next time. Bye.